shoot like a girl we've been here introducing ladies to the shooting sports over the weekend so i missed it and you missed it i'm sorry yep we're we're leaving right now we've been here all weekend inside our trailer we have a rifle range an archery range and a pistol range oh my range. goodness and we invite ladies and their families to come in and we just introduce them to all three platforms we have a gun bar outside the front of our trailer where we can uh, teach ladies how to purchase firearm go to a gun counter or buy a firearm for themselves and that's what we're doing that's here. incredible I, and i missed it i'm sorry you missed it is it just for girls or guys could do it too we let the men do it um and where are you headed now we are headed to reno nevada next. Ah. you can go on facebook and find shoot like a girl.com and you can track us on there. You can follow our schedule and see where we're going. What, what would your message to Joe Biden be right now? <laughs> I can read your mind, I think. Yeah, but... well, we're not going to talk about that. So what's your first name? My name is Melanie. Melanie, I'm Larry. What's your name? Kelly. Kelly, this is the team. Hi, Lisa. And Janine. Tell me about our Second Amendment protecting our First Amendment. Do you believe that? I do. If we need to? Absolutely. Absolutely. You ever heard of shooters up in Rifle? The, the restaurant shooters? I have not. The girls carry up there. All, all the waitresses really? or servers. Yeah, it's a really cool. And our local representatives really, uh, again, advocate too. But um, I, I really want to thank you for what you're doing, the awareness that you're promoting. Because I, I'm not really a gun-toting guy, but I'm getting back to it because I feel push comes to shove. We have the last line of defense, which is the Second Amendment. Well, we really, our message is we promote um, gun safety and gun responsibility. So... That's what we have to offer. That's what we bring to the table. Any last thoughts, ladies, that you heard what I was asking? Just what could we do for America right now? I mean, really. You know, to empower women for sure. And this gives everybody the opportunity to come in, try it, see what they like. You know, not listen to everybody's opinion, but come in here and get prepared to protect yourself. You know, And, and how, important, how important is that to protect ourselves? I don't think it's an option these days. I think everybody has to. You can't wait for somebody to show up. And I'm with law enforcement, and I would still say that you really can't sit and wait for EMS or police or AAA to come to your rescue. And I agree, and I've done work with law enforcement, I've worked in law enforcement. Here's what I see after 20 years of interviewing veterans, I see we are fighting for the same freedoms in our own country today that our veterans have fought for on a foreign land. Do you agree Thank with that? Do you agree with that? Thank you for working. We're, we're fighting for the same freedoms. And the people that don't know that are gonna have a rude awakening or wake up to the fact. So I, I really, I love what you're doing. I'm sorry you're leaving, but. I just want to thank you. What was your first name? Thank you for what you all, all you girls do. We had a good interview. I just had a good conversation with the ladies about guns. And I said, I'm, I'm out thanking truck drivers too. What was your name? Daryl, thank you. I'm Larry. I'm out thanking, but I interview war veterans and thank them for their service to our country. Awesome. And I saw the ladies here and I just had to get involved in this. But I've been thanking truck drivers for three months too. So thank you for what you're doing. God bless you. All right. Thank you. Folks, what a day. I'm back with my trucks. I'm back with my new hobby. And you can see it right here. You can see it right here. There we go. Shootlikeagirl.com. Amen. Larry Capetto for the Real News Network for Larry TV. Amen. God bless them all. God bless them all. Our Second Amendment protects our First Amendment. Amen. Amen.